What is going on everybody? Big D here and I am in the house bringing you guys a tutorial on how to change Eclipse frames per second. This is a tutorial that could help anyone between someone in a clan who records to an editor to a commentator if you want to have your stuff render out faster. A uh, hint hint. <laughs> Anyways, this clip right here can clearly see it's 59.94 frames per second. If you have Adobe After Effects, you just grab your clip, drag it onto that thing, it makes a new composition with your clip in it. Now whenever my damn thing will load, here's your clip, it's in its own little thing, perfect to its settings, size, frame rate, everything. Now all you gotta do is you gotta go to the composition settings, which you can do by either right clicking on the composition down here, or clicking composition, composition settings. You just change your frame rate to what you want. In this particular case, we're going to drop it down to 29.97, and then we're going to bring it into Sony Vegas and bring it back up to 59.94. All right, so 29.97, hit OK, then you just render it out. Composition, add the render queue. Show load, you do whatever your settings are you always do. I'm just going to leave it as an AVI file. Why not, right? Yep, that's a good enough name for me, and she's going to render out. I'm going to caps lock it so I don't have to... Oh, that's something I should show. This is a cool trick. For all of you people who make videos, right? And you know there's the thing in Adobe After Effects in particular, that when you hit render, you have the preview on your screen, and you have to caps lock so it doesn't show the preview and it renders faster. All you have to do is click on this little X right here, and then hit render and the whole thing's gone and I'm not gonna have sound on this clip but oh well anywho I'll be back when this is done rendering out and we'll go into Sony Vegas and bring it back up to 59.04 frames per second I'll be back in a moment everyone till then hello my name is Big D do 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 so she's almost done rendering. We had some little elevator music, you know, through the waiting process, which is pretty cool. So just as a recap for the Adobe After Effects portion, you put your clip in, you make your clip a new composition, you click Composition Settings, Go to your particular frame rate you're looking for, hit OK, and render that biatch out. When she's rendered it out, you find your clip. What is this one? This one. This one here. I think. This one seems longer than this one. I don't know. I did it twice. It's got to be this one. Okay. Fuck. Shit. It's going to mess up. She's going to mess up. She's going to freak out. She's gonna freak out. I'm freaking out. It's freaking out. I'm freaking out. We're all freaking out. Let's go back to desktop on this folder because I put the thing in the wrong thing and now it has to load the thing. So now we'll put the thing back in here. Whoo! That was a lot of words and a lot of thing. There's a lot of thing in that sentence. I pardon if I'm just rambling. Holy moly, guacamole. We don't need that or that or this. Leg. Leg. Okay. Here's this guy. See? 29.97 frames per second. That's how you change it, right? From 59.94, 29.97. I don't think I put audio on this. Yeah, I didn't. But it's the exact same clip. Looks the same. I'm on quarter quality, so it doesn't look that good. It's bumper up to full. See right there? Looks decent. Let's, let's go back to this guy. Put her up to full, too. Loady, loady. McLoadersons. Loady, loady some more. There. That's where the shot is. See if we can find the bullet. A little bit more. A little bit back. A little bit more. Let's go over here. Oops, too far. See? They look pretty identical. Yeah, because they're the exact the exact same. They're just the frame rate's different, which is awesome. So now is it loaded yet? Nope. She's still freaking out on me. Okay. Let's put her in here. And as you see, you're gonna stop playing. As you see, it says 29.97 frames per second. So let's put our 29.9 frames per second soundless clip because obviously I didn't put the sound on because I'm a Jodo face. 
what you want to do is you make sure your properties is set to your 59.94 or your designated frame rate you want with your width, height, and whatever else you're going to do for your particular video. Make sure you sound on and whatnot. Select your render area, which I have selected. File, render as. When she pops up, change her to default template, and it'll just make it your 59.94 exactly what you want. Save that fart knocker, and she'll load. I don't, I'm not sure how long she's going to take, so I'll be back when she's done, ladies and gentlemen. Do 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 do. I'm not doing it. Do 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 do. Alrighty, so we're back. The clip rendered out. We're gonna find it. I think it was this one. Sure, why not? Let's use it anyways. This should be it. I think yeah, I didn't give it a name. And here it is. And here you go. Fifty nine point nine four frames per second. So just to recap, you get your twenty nine point nine seven frames per second clip. Preferably with sound on it, because everything's better with sound. With that clip, you drag it down. You go File. Properties. Make sure your project template thing is set for 59.94 frames per second. Select your render area. Render as. Give her a sexy name, and I go to default template. Default template works very well, because it keeps your templates frames per second, sizes, everything. And that is that. And you're golden. That is how you change a clip to 59.94 frames per second or 29.97 or 24 or 68 or 900, whatever you want to do. That is how you do it, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoy this tutorial. Like, subscribe, comment. This girl is sexy as hell. I don't remember her as Vivian something. She's smoking little lady. I'd take her out back like old Ellie, you know what I'm saying? Auga. A new. What's that? A new Singing with Strangers is coming out in a few days. I think three or four I'm going to post it up. It's pretty chill. We got someone singing Backstreet Boys with me and some other stuff. It's it's looking pretty awesome. That is all. This is already ridiculously long for such an easy thing. Cheers, everybody. Cheers.